Most boys at some time or other want to be a sailor when they grow up, as befits a country with such proud seafaring traditions. So what better than, as the prize for winners of a competition organized by a children's comic, a day out with men and ships of the Royal Navy. First stop for prize winners seven-year-old Donovan Crouch of St Albans, Hertfordshire, Colin Kite, 11, of London, and Richard Startin, 13, of Birmingham, with their officer escort, is HMS Ark Royal, Britain's newest and most up-to-date aircraft carrier. Wide-eyed, the boys are welcomed aboard by Commander McIntosh, DSO, DSC, and then taken on an inspection tour of the carrier. The Ark Royal can operate the heaviest and fastest types of aircraft envisaged in modern naval warfare, more rapidly and with greater safety than any former carrier of the Royal Navy. And the boys are given an illustration of its tremendous striking power. First Ark Royal was built late in the 16th century for Sir Walter Raleigh and took part in the battle with the Spanish Armada. But these Beaufort's anti-aircraft guns are more reminiscent of grim actions on board the last Ark Royal, also an aircraft carrier, which was sunk by a torpedo in 1941 after a dynamic career. Another highlight of the day is a visit to HMS Victory, Nelson's famous flagship and her great battles are fought again in the imaginations of the boys as they examine the historic relics that are preserved for posterity. Marked today by a plaque is the spot where Nelson fell, yet another moving symbol of Britain's naval glory on board a fine ship. The visit over, the boys return after a thrilling day, first to Portsmouth and then to their homes to dream of new naval traditions to be founded. By them, of course.